got Mikey. <laughs> so what the? Excuse you. Right. <laughs> Yo, what's going on you guys? This is your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer. You're my lovely wife Jenny Lee on the ones and twos, and this is We Ain't Seen Reactions, the place where we react to everything we've never seen. And today we are reacting to some more TMNT 2012. Time to get shelled. Uh yeah, man, um, it's been going down. I ain't gonna yeah, lie to you, man. Yeah. S is all around the board. This whole series, like this whole season in general, is getting an S because Yeah, this whole season series, but especially this season though. Yeah. This season just has something that one and two I mean two was good. Don't get me wrong. But no, this two one... was great, but this one just has something that one and two didn't, which was I don't even know what it got, but it got it. <laughs> and I don't know I what you got, it. but you got it. You sick with it? Right, I love this darn season. I love most of these episodes have been centered around some sort of horror movie. Mm -hmm. Um, the last two was Jason and Jigsaw, Jason and Jigsaw, <laughs> JJ, Get jiggy with it, right? So, I Jigsaw Saw used to be my favorite horror movie franchise. So, that last one, when I said we thought it looked like some saw stuff with the camera in the room and yeah. the trap but then i say okay if somebody says i want to play a game then we know it was saw and here come yeah. karai it's time to play a game it's time to play the game i was like wow so i enjoyed that last episode they all had to work together to get out of their traps which was great yeah i knew it was going to involve them doing something together it's like they had to put all their minds together in order to overcome that those obstacles that they were put in which were very genius and metaphoric especially like the hot room which is like basically like oh yeah a hot room for a hot head like Ralph. yeah <laughs> you a know? hot room for a hot head it's like a brain game for a brainiac the turbo ginsu for a leo right you know? and a toilet <laughs> I mean, I thought they could have did some sort of pizza sort of trap, but yeah. I guess the toilet works because he be putting, he be damn near be putting boo boo on his pizza. So right. I mean, why uh, not? A good old ooze swirly will never hurt. Or, right, well, and it, I don't know what to do with a Mikey, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> anyway, so yeah. Yeah, man, I'm um, not going to waste any more time. We're going to go ahead and jump into this next episode, which is titled Dinosaur Seed in Sewers. Uh oh. About to get some Jurassic 5 up in this mofo. Uh, let's do this. Months ago, Kurtzman was the fuck? The creature, but it vanished. I thought it was a hoax until these reports started to resurface. What's the name of those things, the guys? Seen they always be up in uh, Ninja the Turtles. No, those Tyranna things. It was a dinosaur. Hmm. Eat that leatherhead, pigeon Pete. No, oh, they're searching the south side of the sewers. Whoa, 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 whoa. Turn up the volume a little I bit. I can feel its presence. Don't tell me the people that they think are dinosaurs are the Ninja Turtles. That's got to be a Triceraton. No, because Spike knows uh, that there are layers down there, so that would be it. Grasp its mind. Nigga. It's frenzy. About to grasp your conscience and knock the hell out of you. Yay! Triceratons are awesome. Transformers Beast Wars. <laughs> right. Coming to with your new <coughs> Mutators! Smash them all! Damn! This thing have a redneck accent? The Otters, they say. <coughs> what mind or not? The Otters. withstand this! Shit. Crush them all! <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, man. Oh, shit. He always getting his helmet knocked off. He might want to put a chin strap on that. Yeah, man. Gonna get your oodles and noodles knocked out, bruh. Oh, Crocknard demolishes that dumb old dragon. Spooch, spooch. <laughs> <laughs> Take that. Yeah. Those were the most non-powerful swords I've ever seen. How? <laughs> What happened to you was going to cleave the dragon into you. His little thong of uh, crown is off. <laughs> really? Just like that? <laughs> it? After all those adventures, he just bites it? I mean, he really wasn't giving it his all right there. They had to write him off somehow. They probably got canceled because of low ratings. Wow, talk about a bummer ending. Did you think... <gasps> 
shit, 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 it's a wrap. Hey. Uh, here, come, here, come. <clears throat> uh, hey, man, what's, uh, what's, what's going down? You jerks didn't watch the Krognar finale while I'm stuck on Shredder Patrol, right? <laughs> what? No, of course not. But I bet if we did watch it, that we'd mask makes him look like a turkey. Climactic. Yeah, well, you better wait until. Mm -hmm. Wait, hey, hey. Oh shit. Uh, Rockwell, Doc. Where are they? Where is he? Or should I say, it is the better question. And the answer is gone. For now. What kind of it can knock slash out cold? Of being not of this world. Why you got them fish no pantyhose? I knew. Like, what, what the, the fuck? hell? Dino man. Dino Man. Wait, Dino Man? Alien. Where you going, brother? If some dino alien is living in my sewers and beating up my friends, then I'm gonna return the favor. Do be careful. He gonna clean He's that uh wiggle puss in two. Frantic and hits like a runaway bus. Oh. <laughs> Noted. Now get back to the lair so Splinter can patch you up. This nigga got on leggings and shit. He got on a very suspectuous outfit. I'm just he saying. He's like, nigga, like a mystical scripper or something. I was about to say. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, do you want that? Uh, those dollars in ones or yen? Did you say Dino Man? As an urban legend, Dino Man from the news? He's no legend. He's real, and he's more powerful than you could ever imagine. Alas, we tried to stop Raphael from going alone, but that hothead's about to get himself into some hot water. Hey. <laughs> what the heck? Zod's ready. <laughs> the beacon. Orders must triangulate now. Back off, Dino Man. <laughs> Y'all was getting sick of playing with Dino Man. I know. This nigga has Look, specific man, orders. I don't want to hurt you. And I'm not sure I can. <laughs> New trainers are close. <laughs> that ain't finna be it, bro. Damn. I'm horny! <laughs> Literally. <laughs> All expulsion zero on mission status. I think about freaking you! Come on! Orders! I got your orders right here! <laughs> Little ass fingernail fans. I knew it. Destroy the crane! <laughs> that is not the crane, bro. the crane? He's from a different dimension. Shit. Captain Moza, orders now. <laughs> orders for the beacon. Yeah. Orders are stop. On whose authority? Uh, me, Commander uh, Zoroff in charge. Here, now. Of you. <laughs> <laughs> Get your dusty bargain off of me! Alert tribe troops to crime! Smash them the bits! There you go. General Ralph reporting from KO35. Orders, sir! Then I order you to find the crane! Zog has the trail as Zorath commands. Head down, horns up! <laughs> Head down, horns up! Let's booty, booty popping. No. About time. All right, we're here. What's this all about? <gasps> Somebody's head's gonna get grabbed. False alarm, Zog. Holy Chalupa. The Dino Man's real? Mm. Have you tamed him? Sort of. He likes smashing stuff. Isn't that right, soldier? Hold up, Rack. <laughs> Did you forget the part where he beat down half the mighty mutant? I smashed my wife yeah, every other night. On the way. Go get him, Dude. soldier! Mm -hmm. Dude, the Krang are gone. We kicked them back to Dimension X, remember? Raph is like and the Paul Heyman to this guy's Brock Lesnar. Right? <laughs> that is the perfect Zog says they're still yeah. here, and he can sniff them out. Zog Lesnar! Zog. Zog will lead to Krang. Olzog's spaceship crash landed a few months back. He's been taking out the Krang's secret bases ever since. He's on our side! And you trust him? Well, we bonded over a mutual love of destruction. What's up, Zog? You find something? <coughs> he apparently got lung cancer. You need to help him out. Right. Backwards talk. 
his people, the Triceratons, need nitrogen to breathe. Ah, he's a mostly rational guy. Arches on. Stomp the mutators. What? Stop Dance off, ammo. bro. The invasion began. <laughs> oh, he was right. Yeah. It is the one called the turtles. <laughs> I thought they were gone. And they were back. And the one called Try 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 That's the first time I've seen the crane one. Right. I don't miss these guys, but I do miss doing that. Me and Dog will take these two. Head down, towards up. Mutators! Yes! Try to put these horns into action mode and stomp out asses! Oh no, not those type of asses! I eat booty for breakfast though! Bitch! <laughs> now, if only that was like. <laughs> Make your invasion defeat to the end! Whoa! Hey, thanks, big guy. Alert the beacon. Send the troops. The crank. Have the back door to space. Uh, can we come back to that? I'm about to pinpoint Crank's secret hideout. No. Crank! This man will stop at nothing. Or we could just smash it to pieces and never find so out. What, I, what the fuck do I look like? An incredible thunder lizard? I'm not! Are you really still mad about the finale? Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> I knew you watched it. Of course watched you did. It. You know we should be able to find this dimensional Dorito doorway. Foxhole, soldier. Sir. Never give up. What? That's what I got him for. New trainers are close. There. The Statue of Liberty. That's the first time I Is a crime base? Wow. I mean, it kind of makes sense, right? In plain yeah. sight, nobody would ever the think that. They are using the Statue of Liberty. As a base! That's just evil. The beacon must uh, be destroyed. The beacon must go! No choice! Rally them! Awesome job, Sergeant Zog! You ready to do this? Project Pink Beam. Looks like they're trying to open a portal. And if they bring oh, all those tactics through, we're all basically doomed. Not on our watch. I've got a plan. Listen close because we've got to be precise about it. Filthy Krang, horns up! <laughs> I knew that was going to go straight to hell when he said, listen close because we got to be precise. <laughs> uh oh! Damn! They prepared. <laughs> What's up? What do you have? <laughs> <laughs> I still can't believe Dino Dude was right about the crane. And what's this beacon he keeps talking about? Well, it would be a twist if this nigga's race tries to take over. <gasps> and the crane are their rivals. Right. A utility belt? Oh, shit. That's all his gear, huh? Oh, that's his nitrogen? Good shit. At last. It'll be funny. He's like, at last. Good, because it's time to bounce. All right, fine. Commander Zoraf orders you to bounce. Wow. They're probably both trying to take over, but they're the crane yeah. rivals. So, I guess the lack of nitrogen was making him go delusional, but now he has all his sense back. What happened? Did you get cranged up? You can win AWOL. Zog found his old equipment, and then he... Turned on me. You were right, Leo. It happens to the best of us. Hey, Zog! You're not sore about the whole, you know, Commander Zoraf thing, are you? No. Phew. I expect such treachery from the likes of Earth. Mm -hmm. You Earth dwellers are full of lies and deceit. Hey! Who you call an Earth dweller? Look, man, I'm sorry, but you were kind of being a jerk and I had to chill you out somehow. What exactly are you doing with that bomb looking thing? It's not a bomb. It's a signal beacon. Phew. Just signal the Triceraton Empire's armada. 
to come and wipe out this crying infested planet. Damn. I mean, so he don't want to just wipe out the crane. He want to wipe out the whole planet. Right. I understand what you're trying to do, but the way you're going about it is not. It's all wrong. Ooh. Mikey Yo-Yo. Y'all shouldn't have let that man find no damn night to do Goddamn uh, baby we bop from uh, Barney we that went crazy. Together. Right. Don't do this, man. Don't do this to our world. That's not yeah. baby bop. That's BJ. All right. Shit, yeah, we I need baby, baby bop to talk some. the triceratops, though. Oh, both yeah. of them are triceratops. BJ wasn't the triceratops. Yeah, Pretty sure he was. Sorry, baby you, bop so had that kind of head. She had a plate around, around her head. Uh, BJ had a triangle uh, head. I would know. I watched Barney more recently than you. It's my strong Long one. Live the Triceraton Empire. Well, fuck you too, Mufasa. No! No! <laughs> yeah, they coming. Sir, fuck. We received the signal beacon. It is deep in subsector 919837 on an unevolved third world planet called Damn. Earth. And unevolved third. <laughs> right? Basically, I mean, they're not. We don't. Yeah, we are. Primitive. Sheesh. Just imagine you look up in the night sky and some shit like that is coming down. I know, right? It's like, what do you do? Like, you just hope they're nice. That's all you can do is like, oh, I hope they're nice. I know, right? I was like, what in the apples and bananas is going to happen now? Like, so many go? questions. What do we do? We just have to pray that they haven't been here before and that they don't know the terrain. All right. We also have to answer the question, was BJ can't. a Triceratops? Maybe they can't breathe the air. Maybe they can't. If That's... he was a Triceratops, then uh, he wouldn't. But Both I of them. I think both of them was Triceratops. You're trying to make it seem like BJ. I mean, I guess they could both be a Triceratops since they were siblings, but he doesn't look like her. He That's doesn't, the thing. He doesn't it's like she was same. green and he was yellow. Whatever the no, case may be. He, whether they were green or yellow, they don't look alike. They don't have the same form. Her, she has a plate. He has a fucking cone head. Okay. Yeah, you're gonna look it up. We already know. He I, loves to Google stuff. I, I, to I'm sorry, it. guys. Let's get back on the main topic at hand, man. The Triceratons have always been a long term, uh, you know, faction of the Rogues Gallery or the TMNT. So, um, anytime they come into play, that means things are about to get real. I don't know why I stopped recording because <laughs> we got a whole another episode. But <laughs> yeah, it's me. I'm gonna prove you wrong. You ain't gonna prove a goddamn thing. <laughs> yeah, it's uh I don't know how it's gonna end. It's like like, okay, this guy he had the um crane shaking in they damn robotic boots. <laughs> you know, that they, means that they're more advanced than the yes. crane, I guess, or the shoe. They cool I'm ready. Deep. I am ready to see what is gonna happen between these damn triceratons. And yeah. these turtles and the rest of the world. Because, I mean, the, the Triceratons, they look so cool. Oh, this is the last episode of the season? Yeah, Annihilation Earth. That's what it's going to be called. So they they coming out with a vengeance. Earth, your ass ain't ready. All of all the different mutants are probably going to have to like reunite or join uh, forces with the turtles. I wouldn't even be surprised if the Krang had to join forces too to stop these mofos. If the Krang, if the Shredder, if everybody. Right. Hey, man. What would you I'm rate ready. that one? Um, I don't even know. I feel like I want to get that on an A+. Plus. Yeah, I'm giving that A+. Plus. Yeah, that was a good episode. Yeah, we had... there thinking he made a friend he only had made a friend because the dude didn't have the nitrogen he needed yeah. and the bacon but i mean it's like the triceratons are kind of evil too because you're gonna wipe out an entire planet but though. that's just because the crane have just made so much of a mess yeah, yeah, because the crane. it's like the, the turtles are a byproduct too because you remember he was like hunt down the mutant or mutations or whatever oh yeah and they have a lot of mutant infestation infestation on planet earth or whatever they call it the number of primitive idiots they have over here yeah <laughs> but uh yeah two a pluses guys but anyways let's say we jump into this next episode which is called annihilation earth let's do this Triceratops sounds so cool. I wish I could have fought a real life dino dude. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. 
That dino dude would have stomped you into a Casey puddle in about five seconds flat. Exactly. Whatever, Raph. Is that my boy Alan? Whatever his name is. Oh shit. That's the Franklin. <laughs> Play the men in black theme. Hey, I lose a car. It went through that Check doorway. It out. Turtles, three one one seven Bayfront Street, midnight. What's that a supposed ball? to be? Is it logo? It's a chess piece. Oh, a bishop. For the record, I still think this is a terrible idea, Leo. It's got to be a trap. Something's up, and I'm gonna find out what. Dudes, this is the same meat warehouse where we fought Tiger Claw. Come on, I know back entrance. Casey, Come on, bro. Every time Leo says, <laughs> that's what you deserve, Casey. I'm Come sorry. On, bro. This is a. What is, why does this one sound so intelligent? And he's so good with weapons. Uh oh! I am not here to fight you. Too late for that! Shit! Oh! Okay, Agent Smith. We ain't seen a crane that good since the first time we seen a crane. And they was beating the damn what's face up. Turtles, refrain from attacking. Believe me when I say I am not your enemy. You can call me by my earth name, Bishop. But you look just like a crane. I was the one who created this body. The other crane copied me. I am a member of the Utram tribe. A small group of Krang defectors. Uh oh, the Utrom? The Krang hive mine many centuries ago. I have broken my Utrom vow not to intervene in earthly matters. <laughs> but I must warn you the Triceratons are coming. Well, you got the, the 3D glasses, though. As in plural? But we stopped the beacon. No, they are coming. And they are carrying enough firepower to destroy the entire solar system. Bishop, why did the Triceratons hate the Krang? For millennia, the two species have fought over Dimension X. The Krang used their intelligence to battle their foe, while the Triceratons relied on brute strength and cunning. Makes it seemed yeah. the Triceratons would win. Krang used the most powerful weapon in the universe, a black hole generator that wiped out the Triceratons' entire planet. <laughs> Only a single Triceraton fleet survived. They vowed vengeance. The battle may have ended. But, but the, the war, war is just beginning. Out. Now, shall we begin? Let's go, man. School us, Crane. For real. Hey, everyone. And we brought a new pal. Agent K. I love him for the music shit. <laughs> Get your ass whooped, then. I do not want to fight you, creature. <laughs> <laughs> I am a judo specialist. I do not trust him. We've well, gotta trust him for now, LH. He's totally cool. He's gonna help us fight the crane. And I thought Triceraton was gonna be uh, Raphael's version of Leatherhead. I guess mm. that would be Spike. Alright, here's the plan. Raph, Donnie, Mikey, and Leatherhead, you take this up. Infiltrate and stop the Technodrome before it launches. And if it does launch, the rest of us will take it out in the turtle blimp. The Technodrome? Leonardo, what is going on here? You just have to trust me when I say the whole world is at stake. And only we can save it. Finally! After two Earth years of repairs, miscalculations, and general two Earth years. the Technodrome So where are the turtles now? 18? Huh? Is that one of the turtles now? 18? I don't know. Probably 16. Uh -huh. It's still not enough juice, baby. You gotta pay the rest of the bills. I thought they killed that one. The problem, Crank Surprise. Oh, and just a sec, old floating one. Just gotta give her some more juice. <laughs> yes, I did it. I ruined the Tendo Troll. I didn't be doing anything. I don't know, they probably wiggle their tentacles on their on each other. Probably. This is always the end game. That is so awesome. Yeah. No. Heads up guys! Oh my god. <laughs> Says heads up after the fact though. I mean that's not their fault. I mean you'd think they'd be more cautious though. Ugh. 
mushroom uh metal things. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Friend. Yeah. I can hear myself think. There you go. Raphael is doing it. He this is. Episode. How many points my boy got? <laughs> 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 Turtle and alligator mutants. I don't think that which is known as four limbs. I don't know why they thought they could just rock right in like that. No, no, no surrender. None. Well, maybe it's a little bit of retreat. <laughs> now this is definitely bad. Hey, Boy, man. Yes. Ultron going out hard. Bishop? Right? Where to, Bishop? This way. I would have Bishop in a double cross now. Bishop might be too cool to stick around. He might get sacrificed. Well, if it isn't the turtles and that stupid alligator thing that shouts cry all the time. What now? The fucking uh, Triceratops. Hmm. Of the galaxy far, far away are headed. Triceratops coming to whoop your ass. He's got a whole space colony. Greetings, sublife forms of Earth. <laughs> I am Captain Mozar of the Triceraton Empire. Let it be known your planet is infested with Krang. An insidious alien bent on mutating Earth into their own home world. We, we Triceratons will eliminate these hideous aliens, freeing you of their vile plans. Unfortunately, your Earth will be annihilated as well. <laughs> that is all. That is all. Yes, when you gotta leave the house. <laughs> Boy, this poor man is probably going to end up in a mental institution. I'm telling you, he's gonna lose whatever little hair he has left, man. It's actually happening. Devil invasion! <laughs> Let's go. Sheesh. Bite her. Bite her. Tea bag you to death. Bishop, you filthy swindling prank. I am an Ultron, just as you once were, brother. Or shall I call you Sub Sub Prime? <laughs> you know I hate that. It's too late to blow this thing. Pair up and grab a ship. Bro, y'all don't ever take instruction yeah. manuals with y'all. I'm driving. <laughs> I want to drive. <laughs> I would hope not to get stuck with Mighty. Look at this dude. He's the happiest turtle in the world. Mars Attacks 2 coming straight to DVD. Right? Straight to DVD. They're heading for the city. Push this thing faster, Leo. Okay. That looks like the damn. Looks like the little beacon that old boy had. It looks like that, but I was gonna say that looks like the damn type of spaceship that everybody ends up trying to record on their potato phone. Oh yeah. They be doing different formations in the sky. Over there. Right. But it's always recorded on a potato. I like that damn ride that uh, it's like a gravity ride. Yeah. It kind of makes the little thing slide up that you attach to. Oh, I hated that. The I love that. I, I loved it the first time I did it. The second time, no. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. What? Your head? <laughs> this man saying I'm gonna die happy tonight. They, there's no way they can survive that, but I know they did. My friends, are you okay? I've always hated roller coasters. Girl, me and you both. I do feel like I'm gonna die when I'm on camp. Mm. 
but my balls are sinking into my chest when I go down. Captain Mozart, we have the Technodrome on target. Excellent. Destroy it. And Why does it sound like they should narrate an Arby's city. commercial? <laughs> we have the meats. The crane, never take this world again. We have the Technodrome. Annihilating it. Finna plow your world with our beam of destruction. Somebody's gonna have to fly up in there and sacrifice themselves. Just blow up the whole thing. Flying Death Star style. I was just letting that happen. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye. No. Please land in the water. You know they are. Right, the thing. The hell? It looks like a weapon. Ah, crud, guys. I think they're heading for Washington Square. Wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah, y'all are good. <laughs> <laughs> he just said, me? <laughs> so you thought. April. I need you and Leatherhead to get Splinter and the rest of the mutant animals. Gather as many of our friends as you can. I'll text everyone a place to meet up, cool? What's the deal, Leo? The deal is we're gonna need all the help we can get. Oh, a little bit. Mm. Their job is to program the black hole generator. All right. Those are the soldiers. <laughs> no limit soldiers. Okay. Well, what Master P is. Right? I would love to see Master <laughs> P as a Triceraton. Oh, no. Look! Have you primitive creatures ever heard of? Rap snacks? This is what I call barbecuing with honey. They're draining the city's energy supply to power up the weapon. You mean no TV? That ain't right! Mm. Alright, team. This could be our last battle. Are you ready? <laughs> Nigga! Well, you know these damn things are indestructible. Take out their weapons. That's about all you can do. Right? This is like fighting a berserker from fucking Gears of War. <laughs> Get plowed and bitch slapped. Well, he lasted longer than your usual, Crane. Damn. Damn. Cliffhanger Johnson. I know, man. It looks like we're going to have to continue. This is a one-parter. Or usually a two-parter. It's two a two-parter, but you know they it messed was a up special. the episode. Yeah, it's it's a special. An hour-long special. Either it was a special or they messed it up. You know how they be combining the yeah. things on this website? Mm -hmm. Okay, well. No, it was a special because on the official website it's combined. Okay. Okay, so uh, I guess we're going to stop it right here and then... One do the the next part <laughs> there we yes. go some assistance that's what i'm oh, talking about fucking yeah. right i'll have you just <laughs> <laughs> the fuck <laughs> Sometime about. The trash man. Well, guys, um, you do realize we're still in extraordinarily horrendous trouble, right? So what do we do? You kick their Jurassic. Jurassic, I love it. Sometime I love about. that. Avengers level threat. Mm. Not this time. <laughs> I thought he was gonna do Hell no. Stomp him in the nuts. Oh god. <laughs> we must stop the black hole weapon from being triggered. 
<laughs> Luckily, he can regenerate. Yeah, hopefully Mondo Gecko is at least durable. Cluck, cluck. Well, that look like that's made out of some vibranium. <laughs> Who is throwing? Oh, he throwing them cars. It's like, I know tell how many people have died up in those vehicles. As usual, his fucking helmet. Damn. Won't you move? Don't sit there. You have plenty of time. This battle is over. You have all lost. Me? Foolish little one. You are coming with me. Yeah. Y'all hit the wrong one on y'all ship. Mike is gonna fuck that shit up somehow. We gotta go, Sensei! Retreat! Everyone retreat! Whew! <laughs> the hell was that dragon? I think that was his tongue. Oh, baby, Mike, come in. Well, I think dinosaurs were cool, but not you guys. Why are you doing this, dino dude? Why can't you just leave Earth alone? Why? Because of the crank. We will not let them take this planet. They want it as a hiding place from Dimension X. A back door where we Triceratons cannot detect them. But we don't want the crane here either. Can't we all just get along? <laughs> no. The decision has been made by the Triceraton Emperor. It cannot be changed. Ooh, Arthur mode. You know damn well you're going to fight them. Gorkasaurus. Should I take him to the brig, sir? No. Ready the psionic extractor. Oh well. Wow. That don't even sound fun. Now Mikey doesn't have enough brain capacity wow. to endure okay. this shit. It looks like it's really gonna hurt. More than you can possibly imagine, creature. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm over this shit. We gotta go after Mikey. Even if we stop the generator, we still have to get him back. Go then. Save your brother. April and I will stop the Triceratons and rescue our friends. Uh, by ourselves? Uh, you're. Uh, this is what I taught you for. Right, Sensei? We will ally ourselves with someone even more powerful than the mighty Mutanimals. Shredder? Who, Sensei? The Shredder. Of course. This machine will drain all of your knowledge of Earth and the crime. I'm and telling you to get out of his brain. They finna be. Diced, chopped, and removed from your puny brain. Man, this is some fucking dead space shit right here. <laughs> ah! I knew he was gonna like it. Triple <laughs> <laughs> bro. That man on LSD. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'll turn that on. Yeah. I knew this was gonna happen. Look at his eyes. Why did you stop? That was better than like hundred million roller coaster rides in outer space. <laughs> Can I please Shut up? Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> what knowledge did you extract? Very little useful information, Captain. Thought the creature seems to have is for a substance called Pizza. Pizza. I knew it. Destroy the pathetic alien. <laughs> whoa, 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 hold up. I know stuff. You know nothing. I know all the secret bases where the crane hide in Dimension X. Mm -hmm. April's feet are so funny looking. They are. Like she got them big ass dog boots on, man. Baby, what did you finna do against the shredder? Hey, girl. Oh, Lord. What do for you? Goddamn yeah. Bebop. <laughs> <laughs> Breaking in here. Are you desperate or just fools? What you gonna do? We're not here to vote! Oh shit. Ah, is Rod steady late for party time? I thought it smelled like a good year tire up in here. Paralyze this nigga. Oh. I wish to know why Hamato Yoshi has come here. Perhaps to end his miserable existence. The world will soon be destroyed. 
Will you sit by and watch? Or will you help us save it? What have you done with Korai? We searched for her, but she is gone. Alive, but vanished from the city. She got flesh. Why? He's telling the truth, Shredder. Karai's still out there somewhere. And if the earth blows up, guess what? You'll never she see won't be. her again. So maybe you can do the right thing for once in your evil life. <laughs> the mothership is approximately 100,000 miles from Earth. Roughly half the distance from the Earth to the moon. All right. I think we're getting the hang of this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, that's the hydraulic, sir. <laughs> she might be doing a better job at driving than that. <laughs> Why would y'all show that? I mean, it at least looked like it was eating ice cream, but. So I understand paying close attention to detail with gravity and shit, but. I'm detecting a unique life signature coming from the closest craft. It's gotta be him. Idiots! They think they can hide. Uh, it's like we, we have you outlined. My brothers are gonna come rescue me and kick your dino butt back to the Stone Age. That's right. Straight back to the 1960s. We shall see. Commander Zork. Oh yeah, he just did it. He's like, yeah, we'll see. Yeah. Sergeant Zark, activate the plasma cannon. Oh, okay. Um, this is disturbing. Ah, uh, don't make me throw up again. <laughs> the Triceratons are locking onto us with their weapons. <laughs> It's like that Cat Williams where he was like, nigga, did you know that I can see you? Right? <laughs> How can they see us, Donnie? Let me touch them and find out. Right? Because no <laughs> they always ask me the stupidest questions, bro. And then because he's always the smart one, they just assume he knows the answers to everything. It's like if I thought this would work and they discovered that it doesn't work, then how the fuck am I supposed to know that? <laughs> oh, that's what you call using your head. Oh, destroy it. Uh oh. Damn. Sheesh. <laughs> Ragers. This is what we trained for, boys. Uh oh. Gonna move out of the way. No. Nice. What did they get beamed up to, though? We're alive. You snagged a teleporter. You mean we could have just beamed here? Oh yeah. There's only one charge, and I. Oh man, we're in trouble. <laughs> Guys, that was awesome. Thanks for the sweet rescue. So who's gonna rescue us next? April? Casey? <laughs> Get down with it. Piggly Wiggly on his ass. <laughs> nice. So I'm talking about baby. Nah, you ain't gonna tell me he finna do all uh, do all that. You ain't finna tell me. Let the earth survive or be destroyed. Nigga, you are in threats. no right. He's in no shape to make threats. No, oh wow. <laughs> Boy, these dudes always escape out of the crazy situations. Wow. Ooh. They hit that Sonya Blade on him. Shit. Please don't tell me you didn't. He did. I hope he did not. Oh no! He did. No, please. Did. Please, this is too much of a childish cartoon for you to do this! I already knew that was gonna happen. Come on, bro! You mother... <laughs> Fuck. Please don't...
don't die, Splinter. I... What do you mean you already knew this? My brother used to watch this show. God damn it. I just didn't remember what season or what, what had happened, but I remember him being really upset that Splinter passed away somehow. <laughs> Idiot! I knew he was going to be on, more focused on that shit. You booger face bastard. Stupid. Tell him what he won, y'all. Looks like a painting come to life. Is that my girl, the time girl? I hope. Hurry! We have much time! The fuck? Do we have a choice? Right? forever in an infinite gravitational singularity. Holy pepperoni. Boopy. Boopy. Count all these mock Dude, who are you? My name is Professor Zayton Honeycutt, and you, my friends, are about to embark on a wondrous adventure. This is it. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if y'all noticed, but that shit really got to me right there. I knew it was gonna happen. Not that way. I didn't know how. I just knew. What's the name? Um, Sweat Shredder doesn't care about helping anybody because he didn't help the last time the Krang invaded. So I knew he didn't like. He didn't care about nobody and nothing else. He just his whole life mission was literally to kill a dude over a woman who didn't want him. It's like, that was his entire life's mission. Okay, it's like, I thought that, okay, it's well within his character to do something like that. But I was like thinking the only way he could reach the button is if he impaled Splinter and the claw actually... No, he didn't care about the button. He just wanted a, a way to get to finally do what he wanted to do. Now, he had to do it from behind. He couldn't do it in his face because he... Every time him and Splinter fought... It wouldn't, it didn't go like he thought. I, I knew it. I, I should have given him the benefit of the doubt that he would do that. You know what I'm saying? But that's just, once again, masterclass storytelling from the writers of this, this show. Now, I don't know if some type of way he comes back or they don't even say it. Due time. I have no idea. Don't even say it. It's like I, I once felt envious for being a third wheel and a person that didn't know a lot about all the stuff that took place in this show anytime somebody talked about it. But I'm actually enjoying this ride, and I'm glad that I did not know that they were going to end on that note, you know, because that adds so much weight, because that's a thing that no writer has dared to do, at least before this show, which is kill off Splinter, a very integral part of the Turtles. Yeah, well, I really don't know if he comes back, but I did know he died somehow, because my yeah. brother was like, oh no, they killed Splinter. Damn. <laughs> so. Um, Damn! Yeah, and I don't know what year this would have come out if it came out in 2012. Probably about 2015 or 14. 2013. Yeah, 14 or 15. Yeah, that's yeah. not right. That's about when I remember him saying that. I don't remember if he watched the next season or what happened. But yeah, so um, for now at least, R.I.P. Splinter Man. Yeah, man. He went out like a true G, except he should have never trusted his stupid brother to make the right call with that one. Imagine. Being that right? Yeah. That you would do that. Sometimes a person will destroy their entire house just to kill a rodent, though, so whatever. 
Uh, get that episode of S. That was a good finale. Yeah, I definitely got to get that in S. Double S, S man. S plus. <laughs> like, the stakes were very high on it. Just when you thought the crane couldn't be topped, we it's like the Triceratons. I don't right. know where this is going from here. I'm I like, don't know. This shit is going to be like... Where can they go? Ninja Turtles fast forward from the uh, 2003 version, which <clears> sucked <throat> ass. So, hopefully, this doesn't repeat the same mistakes as that one. You know, I haven't seen it, but I heard it's not the best in terms of writing. But it seems like Nickelodeon were giving the writers and showrunners a lot of leeway to do whatever they want, whether it came down to a lot of lewd potty humor and the fact that they allow death to occur in this show shows that, you know, Nickelodeon put a lot of trust into them because it was successful around the time. So why wouldn't they? But, uh, yeah, I can't wait to see what's going to happen next. You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, man. Here's to a new season. We're heading off into season four. So, yeah, I can't wait to see how this one turns out. I love the new channels. Right. Um, but anyways, guys, um, if there's anything that you want to add to this or comment, by all means, be our guest. And if there's anything that we may have missed or gotten misconstrued, be sure to provide the proper context in the comment Don't section below. You dear. Don't Spoilers. you dare. You're going to get hit upside the head with a plastic bottle if you do. Bop. But uh, yeah, this is your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer. My lovely white gentleman on the ones and twos. We ain't seen the reactions. We'll catch you guys on the next reaction too. TMNT 2012. <laughs> RIP Splinter. <laughs> F's in the chat. <laughs>